Okay, this is just gonna be a really quick video, something I just discovered by accident here. And many of you will recognize this as a accurate weather station. It works very good. I've had it for uh, well six months now, or getting close to six months. And uh, like it a lot. Uh, and I was sitting here, and I bought the, and I did a video a few, a few days ago with my little plasma globe. You can see it sticking here in the corner. I did the video the other day, and I was going to put it over by the weather station, and I wanted to make sure that the plasma globe wasn't going to cause reception problems from the outdoor sensor. Now, it's surprise, you know, and I, I got a real surprise. Now, watch what happens when I bring the plasma globe closer to the display unit. Look at that. It trips the button as though you're controlling the, the display dimmer button. Every time I bring it within a certain range, doesn't it? It thinks I'm pushing the dim control button. I'm not touching it. And you can see I'm not touching it. I'm just, uh, when it gets out over, I have to, look, I have to pull back a little bit, come in. And every time the little plasma globe is uh, doing it, it's not, it's not affecting the signal reception. I can still see the signal reception is fine. But when, you, when it gets up, the globe gets close to it. It it makes it it acts like it's pushing some somebody's pushing the dim button, which is the little button up here, which I can do manually. So that was an interesting little discovery. So I just thought I'd do a quick video and show show. I wonder if anybody else did this happen, but uh, I'm guessing it's probably just a, a normal phenomenon. But uh, I never thought of, thought of it to do. That. It was a real surprise to me. So I just thought I'd post it and let, let everybody else see that see it and. Uh, but uh, I said I'm quite happy with with both the plasma globe and the uh, accurate system. So this is Atari Hotel. I hope you like it.